free clinics see only uninsured people, typically adults. The care that they provide is free, thus the name free clinic. People that come to free clinics are often uh, people of very few means, that are very hardworking individuals. I think there's a myth out there that the patients that come to safety net clinics are ne'er-do-wells who sit home on welfare and don't have any motivation. And in truth, most of the patients that come here have multiple jobs and are trying to scrape by, but work for employers that either can't afford to offer them health insurance or they can't afford to purchase it themselves. Sentara Healthcare is an amazing partner to the safety net organizations in the community. We really couldn't function without the help of the health systems. Several of the ways that the Sentara Health Foundation and Sentara provide that community benefit as part of the health safety net are first, the grants that the Sentara Health Foundation makes to our area's community health centers and free clinics. So in 2012, we provided over $600,000 to support our area's free clinics and community health centers to continue to provide free and reduced cost care to our area's underserved and indigent patients. Community health centers, on the other hand, are all full-time medical practices. Hampton Rose Community Health Center has four locations, one in Portsmouth and three in Norfolk. But it was through the Sentara Foundation that they really extended themselves in providing for us much needed funds so that we could sustain ourselves because of the rapid growth that we saw with the uninsured population at our Norfolk site. There is going to be a significant need for the healthcare safety net long into the future. And there are a lot of different opinions about the new health reform law and what it's going to look like when it's implemented in Virginia. And a lot of that remains to be seen. But I think the important thing to remember is that if it unfolds in such a way that the maximum number of people in Virginia can get coverage from it, uh, we're still going to have hundreds of thousands of Virginians who are uninsured and need help from the healthcare safety net.